Hi guys, welcome back. If like me, you've been using Campendium to do a lot of your uh, planning on go, where to go, where to stay, uh, how to stay there, what's what's the places I like, um, and you've recently logged into Campendium and found, hello, the map is gone. Well, the map is gone. I have done some research. I've found another um, application or website which is pretty close to Campendium or how Compendium used to be. Hang around to the end of the video and I'll show you what that is. We are on the way. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Brent, um, half of Brent and Janie, um, and Anchors Away RV if you're new to the channel. Right. We've been traveling around the US now for about four or five months, um, and we use Campendium uh, to plan our trips. Unfortunately, Campendium is no longer showing any maps. So if you'd like to find out about an alternative, hang around to the end of the video, and um, I'll show you that. Let's work our way through it, starting off with Campendium. If you're used to Campendium, you know that you can bring a map up and uh, you can discover all of the campsites on the map and you can plan everything out. Very helpful if you don't actually know where you're going or you've never been to a place before. Well, that's gone. They have removed the maps and they've gone trippers instead so they've got the road trippers I believe are, owns Compendium or it's the parent company or something like that and they've just wiped out the maps on Compendium to push you into road trippers so you click on learn more and so you, you get redirected to this page okay so great plan your trip where are you going we'll go Vancouver Canada there we go All right. where are we going to well, we don't know where we're going. That's the whole idea. You want to plan a trip and you don't know where you're going. Stick in a random place, Yellowstone. So, National Park. Go. Go. Didn't give me anything at all. Search road trip. New trip. Yeah. Hey, we've got a map. All right, so main food. It's the campsites. Show me the campsites. We've got a national park. <laughs> Some campsites here, it's a national park. Right, so you're getting really close into the map before anything is showing up. Let's let's go there. Add the trip. Right. How do you want to plan your trip at this point? I'd like to plan myself. Okay. It's just happened. Free waypoint left. Click here to upgrade your membership. Basic. Basic is thirty six bucks. Five to our save trips. Three save trips. Twenty stops per trip. Fifty stops per trip. 
150 unlimited trips. Well, that would be like Ampendia. Uh, so this is a, a trip planning website, not a campground website. Um, and it's 60 bucks a year for that. So, would you like an alternative? How about, let's zoom out of the map. Does that remind you of anything? Yeah. 1,749 locations. And zooming in on the map. Gonna make a lie out of it. I'm planning a trip from Vancouver. I want to go to Seattle first. There's 169 places to stay in Seattle, and it splits it into the areas. Here we go. I don't know what's in there. There's four campgrounds in there. Uh, one of them's a water spout. Two of them are water spouts. Tolk McDonald Country Park. All right, what's that? Very nice. Pull through big rig sites and tent camping area. Big grassy area in the middle of the RV loop. Short walk, popular swimming beach. Reservations required. Remind you anything? Start using iOverlander. That's what I'm going to be doing. Here. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time.